ISTQB Foundation Level Version 93. High-level test conditions are being used by testers to generate test cases and execute tests. Even though the test conditions remain the same, the test cases are varied each time. Which of the following principles of testing is being addressed through the variation of test cases? A. Tests wear out. B. Absence of defects fallacy. C. Early testing saves time and money. D. Defects cluster together. Take a moment to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to don't miss new ICQB questions and answers that will help you guaranteed and changing your skills. Join us on this learning journey. If you find value in that I do and my videos help you, then you have the option to donate through the links in the video description to I can release new videos on ISTQB questions on a regular basis. Correct answer is A according to ISTQB syllabus. The test wear out principle is concerned with the idea that repeating identical tests on unaltered code is unlikely to uncover novel defects and therefore modifying tests may be essential. By using high-level test conditions to generate new tests each time, the test will not be identical and should not we are out. All the rest of the answers are wrong. Answer B is invalid because the absence of defects fallacy principle is concerned with ensuring that users' needs are fulfilled even if lots of testing is done and no defects are found, i.e. validation is also necessary. The use of high-level test conditions to generate test cases and execute tests does not directly address this concern. Answer C is invalid because the early testing saves time and money principle is concerned with fixing defects early on to prevent the occurrence of subsequent defects in derived work products thereby reducing costs and the likelihood of failures. This is typically addressed by starting testing, both static and dynamic, as early as possible, but this is not addressed by using high-level test conditions to generate test cases and execute tests. Answer D is invalid because the defects cluster together principle is concerned with the distribution of defects in a system, which typically follows a Pareto distribution. The use of high-level test conditions to generate test cases and execute tests does not address this concern, which is typically addressed by risk-based testing. My recommendation, please figure out all seven testing principles with examples and don't mix up them. Explanation. Finally, let's look at the section 1.3, testing principles in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see that the testing principle 5 is tests wear out. I suggest you figure out all seven principles on you own. I sincerely believe that you are on the right way and won't miss such a unique opportunity to prepare for ISTQB Foundation level exam very thoroughly, according to my YouTube channel, for absolutely free. Never give up.